if you're I know a lot of you don't have the DLC if you don't want to see any spoilers I'm not really doing anything within the city except for just getting fist weapons but yeah I'm not gonna be here for that long either so if you don't want to see any <clears throat> go ahead and close the video and then um, pick us back up soon because we're gonna be out of Harmattan pretty quickly all right love this town greetings friend greetings okay he's got scales which I'm gonna purchase okay what else yeah that's good yeah so now technically I have I have what I need to craft the scaled satchel, which is what I really want with the scales, but um, I'm not crafting anything yet until I actually have the recipe. You better Just have in the case money. you're joining us, you're you know new to this playthrough. I've mentioned it before, but we're not going to craft unless we have the recipe. Okay. I'm gonna need a couple more mineral teas. Well, I do have, actually, well, I don't know the recipe for mineral tea yet. So I'm gonna see what, let's see what we got here. Let's see if we can get, see what we can get recipe wise. Drink some water, gather some water. What do you need? Bread, crawberry jam. Hmm. No recipes that I want there. Can I help you? What else? Okay. Need something? Got some nice fist weapons there. I just don't have the money. I guess I could, but it's kind of advanced. Don't want to get into that until later. How can I help you? Okay. Spiritual varnish, stability. Got some varnishes here that I really like. So, yep, bolt varnish. Go, yeah, ice varnish. Spiritual varnish. Fire varnish. Get all the varnishes. Confirm it. Let's read them all. Nice. All that's been learned. You better have the money. Scaled leather boots, scaled leather hat. Hmm. Look for that scaled leather set. Is there something you need? Scaled satchel and boozoo backpack. I'm gonna purchase both. It's got four scales. Wow. Hmm. Not enough silver. Okay. All right. Let's read the Boozoo backpack recipe and the scaled satchel recipe. Now let's go to our crafting now that we've got that stuff learned. Scaled satchel, there it is. Nice. Gotta have it. Gotta have the scaled satchel. Lantern to bag. Is there something you need? I'm gonna sell you the backpack. My old, just crusty, journey ridden backpack. Just sell it. Imagine how dirty it is. Rolling from the slow dodge roll. Lantern to bag. 
Hmm. What do you need? Ooh, dry mushroom bar recipe is really what I would like. Okay, let's see. Couple junk piles around her mountain. Nice, gravel beetle. Pale beauty incense. Go ahead and read it. Predator bones. Go to the training ground here, the battle training ground. Surge Battleborn, Master of Motion. Want me to train you? I want to train with you. He's got this efficiency skill, maximum stamina increased by 25. Yep. Okay. Elemental resistance, green mushrooms. Nice explorer lantern. Move to back. Attach this lantern. Cool. Got a better lantern now. All right, we're gonna continue to explore Harmatin. There's junk piles, treasure chests. Hopefully we can find some cool things. Firestones, nice. Pitchfork. Treasure chest down this way. Grilled mana heart bass. Star mushroom, firefly powder, machete. I guess it's five silver. I don't know. Okay, this blacksmith here has got our fist weapons that we want. We should. Want to buy something? Yeah, iron knuckles. And then, uh, fang knuckles, yep. Fang knuckles is going to require two iron wristbands, so I'm going to purchase those. Give him another ingot. And give him some hide. Mm, keep those around. Alright, let's go to our recipes. Fang Knuckles recipe has been learned. Craft the fang knuckles with the two wristbands, iron knuckles, and predator bones. Fang knuckles, 20 damage, 13 impact, 1.1 attack speed, inflicts bleeding. Now we're looking at some decent weapons, decent fists. Nice, equip those. Nice, yes. Things are starting to get really comfortable. The bag's overweight. I got a few things to sell though. Rondell dagger, take that. Tattered purifying quartz. Okay, mining pick. I'm going to take that mining pick and put the damaged one in the chest. Gotta get to the blacksmith to sell some things. 
Harmattan, home of Sorbor Academy. It's an option to join this quest line if you would like. Want to buy something? So many, yeah, a lot of gay berry jams. I can get rid of that. I want to hold on to that. It's valuable. Elemental resistance. Yeah, sell all that. Let's decraft the tattered attire. Make some more fire rags. All right. All good, all good stuff right there. This is Sorbor Academy right here. Pretty cool place as well. Jane Vincent, the recruiter. I'm actually gonna go through here. I'm gonna see what, what the uh, alch the recipes this guy has. They have a resident alchemist. Is there something you need? Arcanist. Looking for magical items and tools? I'll give you the student's discount. These are enchantment recipes. You can enchant weapons and armor. Really cool. Hopefully we get that far. Hopefully we survive. Hmm. He doesn't really have... I will take the turnips, though. You can also draw mana from the ley line here. A little less perilous than the uh, ley line in the chairs and knees. A lot less perilous, so you don't fight anything. So keep that in mind. So there's one other guy down here. See if he has any good recipes that I might be interested Can in. Can I help you? Hmm. No. He does have turnips though. Got six star mushrooms. Let's go. Three turnips. That matches that up. Six and six. I feel like I'm gonna need another mineral tea. That's the high class in. Actually, yeah, she's fancy. I usually stay at the uh, low class in. There's two inns. But. I, I, I kind of forget. This character is a fancy character. We'll go to the high class in. Victorious Light in. Something on your mind. Um. Don't tell anyone, but... Hmm? Welcome to Harmattan, friend. If you want to speak with anyone important, I'd advise you to visit Sorbor Academy. If you're into magic, they've got a ley line open for public use, too. No. Antique Plateau. Ha. Such an insult. People literally only call it that because the ruins of our great city scatter the entire length of the place. Less than a century ago, all the region was known as Harmattan. Now it's, it's as if our great legacy has been condensed down to just this one district we call a city. This treatment is disgraceful, I tell you. I didn't get a room. I want a room. Something on your mind. Want us to pay attention. The room is up the stairs. Nice. Door opens for us. All right. What time is it? Eight o'clock. It's a nice bedtime. Sleep for 1, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 in the morning. 5 in the morning in the antique plateau. All right. 
Alright, so what we're gonna do, we got this, um... Boozoo Hide Backpack Recipe. I'm gonna try and get some Boozoo Hides, because I've got the Scaled Satchel. I know that. Let's see if we can get some Boozoo Hide. Let's see if we can craft that Boozoo Hide Backpack. Yeah, it gives us some more carrying capacity. 75 pounds. Corruption Resistance, plus 10. And does not interfere with your dodge roll. That's so crucial for me as a player. My bag's overweight. Okay, for some purpose. You better have the money. I wanna sell. I'm gonna sell my fang axe and my nux. I got my fang I mean my cloth knuckles. Um I'll sell all the mana stones. Sell the arcane dampener. I'll sell most of my fire stones. Okay. Sell most of my elemental rags. And then I'll purchase two ingots. There we go, my bag's looking good now. You better have the money. Sell the lantern. Move astral potions to pocket. Bag's looking real good. Let's head off, see if we can get some boozoo hide. Explore the plateau a bit. I love the plateau. If you've watched the uh, Let's, Dan Let's Dance series, that was a lot of fun. And you know my love of the plateau. All right. Which I, you know, I didn't love it at first. Kind of a dry, arid region. But like almost everything in Outward, you spend enough time there, it grows on you. As things become familiar, you begin to enjoy it. A treasure chest here. That firefly powder. Enchantment recipe, I'll take it. Smoke root firestone. Kazite light armor. Yeah, I'll take the Kazite. Yeah, it's kind of cool. It's not fancy, though. But it is a lot heavier than our uh, red light clothes. And our red light clothes. So, so our shadow, our light armor is going to be in the bag. You know, weighing it down. I'd rather equip it. Get that weight out of the bag. Um, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. It's okay if we're not super fancy for a little bit. I also have a <clears throat> the character that I want to play through. Uh, he's the opposite of fancy. Okay, the primal build. I've got some videos on it. At the channel. Really a fun build. Savage build. Relies heavily on uh, raw meat consumption. So. And if you're interested in that, then check it out. That's a lot of fun, too. Alright. <clears throat> Making our way through the old ruins. The old Harmatan ruins. And our purpose is... To try to get some Boozoo Hide. Got the Boozoo Hide Backpack Recipe. We've got the Scaled Satchel.
Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get some stamina regen going. Mm -hmm. You do have to be careful around the plateau. There's some... There's a little a duo of beast golems that will really put the hurt on you. These rusty sword golems are not really a problem. Yeah, yeah they're just methodically up. Oh, never mind. Spoke too soon, I guess. But they attack slowly. Pretty easy to anticipate them. Left hand, overhand. Nice. Man, it's taking a long time to kill him. Power coil. Cool, probably sell it. I know some of you are saying, but wait, you can you can use it to get it. Epic item. Don't worry, I don't use that item. So we're fine. We're fine. Okay, those are Wolfgang mercenaries. They're friendly. They're friendlies. Unless you join Sorobor uh, Academy. Unless you join the faction. During the quest line, they become hostiles. If you play the way I did, I'm not sure. A lot of the quest lines are dynamic, so... Maybe there's situations when they where they do not become hostile. But I'm unaware of it. Let's get some health regeneration. Should be coming up on some boozoos here. They, they kind of roam around the southland of the of the plateau. Grab some dreamer's root. There's a chance of getting ochre spice. Dreamer's Roots, uh, essential for uh, incense recipes used in enchanting. So, Not going to be digging into that for a while. All right, here's a boozoo. A couple of them. How's our, how's our regens? Stamina Recovery 2. I want to go Stamina Recovery 3. With the Ocean Frequency. Um, we'll refresh on the water. I'll go cool. That way I can cool them up. Rage. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. He's running. Come on now. How is he not bleeding? My fangs and foot bleeding. But yet there he goes. Guzu hide two of them, yes. He's convulsing. A violent death. One more boozu hide. Okay. Okay. Nice. Staggered. Staggered. Come on. Yes, there you go. No boozu hide. All right. We'll have to get another one. Hmm. Well, I'll use a bandage to stack that health regeneration.
What kind of a da what kind of damage am I doing with Cool Boon and Frost? Okay, eight. Not bad. Twenty-eight damage total. There's another Boozu. I feel like I gotta refresh my Cool Boon. Do I? Ninety-five percent. Yeah, better. A minute and a half. Refresh my Ice Rag. Hmm. Oh. Yes. Well, I get him staggered. Yeah. Yes. Nice. Dealt with him. And Buzu hide. Yes. Hmm. Got the Buzu hide. So, it's not going to recognize that I have the satchel because I've got it equipped. So if I unequip this skill satchel must be empty before unequipping. Um, do I have to drop everything? Can't be right. To drop every item? If there's an easier way to empty your bag. I I know if I had another bag I could just put everything in there, but <clears throat> this seems a bit sorry about this, this is bad. Bad film. But bear with us, bear with us, or fast forward. <laughs> fast forward till till we've got it done. Okay. There's got to be an easier way. Tell me in the comments below what the easiest way is. Um. I could have just moved to pocket, I guess. Well, no, that might. Yeah, I don't know. We're dealing with it. We're dealing with it. Okay. Just creating a giant pile on the ground. Okay, unequip. Okay, so. Got our scaled satchel. Unequip it. Yeah, now it's in the pocket. Now I go crafting. Boozu hide backpack. Nice. Now we equip it. Good. Now we proceed to grab. Some of the stuff looks cool. I like this. I kind of like dropping things and looking at them on the ground. Although I wish the gleaming dot was gone that way. So get a really good look of a fe good feel of what it really looks like on the ground in a big heap. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the boozoo's meat. Nice boozoo hide backpack. I love it. Really love it. I like how the lantern is kind of attached to that bull ring, the nose ring. It's cool. My character must be an artisan of some sorts, I mean, to craft that. Greetings, friend. <laughs> Greetings. <laughs> Greetings. Okay. I'm going to sell the power coil. I know, some of you scream at me, it's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. All right. I 
Again, we'll grab some Dreamer's Root. I'm trying to get that Ochre Spice Beetle. Gravel Beetle from the Thick Oil. Yeah, there it is. Gravel Beetle. More Dreamer's Root. That's better. Much better, much better, much better. Yes. How are my knuckles after the... Knuckles aren't great after the Boozoo fight. I got any butterflies. I can sleep near. Some butterflies. Sleep and repair. Butterflies provide a safe zone. Take the bag off as always. And repair for one, two, three, four, five. Sleep for two. Maybe evening time. Evening time is fantastic in every region so I'm stoked about the evening it's not quite evening the way I was hoping Let's drink some water See how this fight plays out. Mana Mantis and Boozu. If the Boozu, let's see, if the Manta Mantis, if the Mana Mantis kills the Boozu, I'm gonna kill the Mana Mantis. If it's the other way around and the Boozu comes out victorious, which looks like he will, then I'm gonna leave the Boozu be. Yeah, he's. Yeah, there it was, Andy. I've harvested enough Boozus. For the hide. Hmm, Mana Lake. Hmm, yes. Beautiful sight. Lots of mana stone to mine. My mining pick's probably decently damaged. Hackmanite, good. Another Hackmanite. Leyline water. Leyline water restores your mana. That's cool. Weber egg nest. Not gonna worry about it. More mana stone. Hackmanite again. Really cashing in. Cashing in. That's 150 silver in the last three mana stones. Oh man. This is Bieber coming at me. I better take stamina regeneration just in case something catches me off guard. I don't want to deal with beavers really. I could care less about the loot they leave. Hoping for a gravel beetle there in the thick oil.
Yeah. Really cool area. I'm a huge fan of the Mana Lake. Got some more mana stone to mine. Gravel beetle. Pack my Another fifty silver. Stocking up on cash right here. After we stock up a few of these items. Probably head out of the antique plateau. We'll come back here, obviously, in time. We got a pure illuminator down here. I think I'll go ahead and have Adam. This could be the end of me, just so you guys know. What am I gonna do? I got I gotta use my possession boon. He deals decay damage. I'll rage up, might as well. And we'll cool boom. What's he, is he doing? Is he fighting something? We'll do our ocean fricassee for better stamina regen. Gotta do our water too. I feel like he's running away from me. Okay, no, he's, he's not. He's not. Yes, make them bleed. Nice. Come on, end him. Yes, thank you. Endurance potion. Take all that. Hmm. care of him. That pure chatine we're going to use in Harmat. There's a, a trainer. Not, not one of the main teachers, but just a trainer of a specific skill. Oh no, what's after me? Okay. Mana Mantis. I'm not going to deal with it. Just gonna outrun it. See that the sketchy thing with trying to outrun. Broken tent. Yeah, I outrun. Wow. Yes. Yes, please. The sketchy thing about trying to outrun an enemy is that you may run out of stamina. And you may not have outran him by the time you run out of stamina. In which case, it's over for you. Unless you weave in and out of rocks and maybe drink an endurance potion. Something that's going to give your stamina a boost, an immediate boost. But, generally speaking, if an enemy catches you and you don't have any stamina, it's not going to go well. Here's that mana mantis that that boozu took out.
bag over weight. Okay, we're gonna get to Harmatin. We're gonna we're gonna sell some things, get get that bag back to being underweight, and then we're going to head out. And again, you can cheese your way through and sleep for three days until a Sorborian takes you to where you want. Where's this Sorborian want to travel? Greetings, friend. Yes. He's going to Berg. Hmm. Greetings, friend. Let's sell... I'm going to sell the Shatine, sell the Hackmanite, sell the Mana Stones. Yeah, this is good. This is good. Sell the Dreamer's Root, get the weight out of the bag. Um... But yeah, you can sleep for three days, and the Soroborian will take you to different places. So if you don't want to travel to a certain spot, just sleep. Come back to him, he'll travel to somewhere else. But I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to... I'm just going to travel wherever he takes me. That guy takes me to Berg, which that's a pretty good option. Might do that. I'm thinking about joining the Blue Chamber. If I get on the inside of the blue chamber, then I can uncover the shadiness of Rissa. Nah, it's actually not a thing. I, I, not that the shadiness is not a thing, but the whole uncovering of Rissa's shadiness. That's not a thing. Those Wolfgang mercenaries are dealing with what? A boozoo? Yeah, I don't know. Got some more mana stones. Temperature, body temperature is going down. As I travel back to Harmatin, I'm going to go through the ruins again. Old Harmatin ruins, the clock tower ruins, and I don't want to get caught by that duo of beast golems. Oh man, now I'm cold. Okay, so let's go bitter spicy. Oh, that helped me. Temperature's back to normal. Nice. A lot of times you got to do more than just bitter spicy tea. you got to do warm boon, which I don't have yet. There's some more Wolfgang mercenaries there. No need to worry about them. But yeah, if it was if it was the dead of winter where it was snowing and things like that, then yeah, the, the bitter spicy tea wouldn't be enough. Ochre spice? Nope. I thought, thought that tree stump was an enemy. Almost sent me into a panic. I'm thinking about maybe doing some of these. I want to start live streaming the, the playthrough. Not really, I don't know if I'm exactly set up for the live stream though. Or maybe it's less complicated than I'm actually thinking. I, I've tried to watch a few tutorials on it, but can't seem to. I guess I just need to experiment with it. But let me know if, you, if you'd like that. Join in on the chat and all that, so. But for now, we're just doing the recordings. 
Okay, this is where I'm going to find those beast golems, you know. If, if they're going to surprise me, it's going to be right around here. Hmm. Just kind of looking for any movements. Trying to minimize sprinting. I think we might be fine. Keep my stamina up. Mm, yeah, we're going to be okay. We're going to be okay. So the archway signifies the entrance to Harmatan. The main entrance. There are a couple different entrances. So that Soraborn is going to Berg. I think I might just travel to wherever this sword boring is going rather than go all the way back down south to where that sword boring is and sometimes the, the caravanners out in the out in the region will they'll move you know they'll relocate to a different part of the region so I don't want to travel all the way down there and then find that he moved somewhere else Okay, so we've got that piece of pure chitin that we got from the pure illuminator. <clears throat> so now we're going to talk to this person here. Mavith. Look at those fist weapons. The marble fists. Dude, nice. Look at that gear. I think he's a wolf, wolf medic. Wolf plate helm. Hey, listen! That's cool. People have forgotten. We were one of the earliest regions hit by the Scourge. We held off the greater bulk of the Horde from pouring into Western Orai. People like to give a lot all the credit for stopping them. And while there's truth to that, if we hadn't held the damn things off for as long as we did, there wouldn't have been much of an Orai for him to save. I want to train with you. So, it sounds like the Soraborians held off the scourge too put him up I'll train ya train ya you really think you have what it takes to learn the prismatic flurry it asks you to bend magical boons with your fists truly emerging of the physical and the spiritual only a few people are capable of it is the plan if you want me to teach you prove to me your body can handle it return and show me a piece of pure chitin from an enchanted scourge beast and I will believe you are capable I've got the item you wanted right here here. This is yours. And lots of breath. He actually did it. All right, let's begin. Prism <laughs> Prismatic flurry. You've got it. It's been ages since I've seen someone else use that technique without collapsing from the strain. You have no idea how happy you've made me today, comforts. Oh, that's nice. So we've got prismatic flurry. Fist weapon skill. Does an extra hit for each elemental boon that's active. So if we've got Miss Boon, Warm Boon, Cool Boon, Possessed Boon, Blessed Boon, then we're dealing five extra hits. It's a devastating skill. It's quite devastating. It's borderline cheating sometimes. But. I'm gonna utilize it. It's, it's not cheating technically. It just seems like unfair when you start using it, when you start perfecting it. All right, let's go to the sore boy and see where he wants to take us. I don't. Let's see. Yeah, there's no other skills in this town that I want to learn right now. I didn't drop anything anywhere, right? I don't think so. Greetings, friend. Greetings. All right, so. Sell the dreamer's root. I'm going to hold on to this stuff. What I'm actually going to do. I'm going to go to the Victorious Light Inn. 
I'm gonna put those items in the chest that's up there. I, I don't think they'll disappear. I, don't, I think they'll I think they'll remain there until we go back here to Harmatan later on. If we're alive, I should say. Put the purifying quartz in, put the enchanting recipe in. I guess with the dreamer's roots, I probably should have uh, just kept them, put them in the chest. That's all right. Not going to worry about it. What's done is done. Can't worry about things in outward as far as things like that. Just got to brush it off. You're going to make mistakes inventory wise. I do all the time. I mean, at the beginning of this whole playthrough, I crafted some bed rolls. I was trying to decraft. Greetings, friend. I want to travel. Yes. Take me to Berg. Cool. All right. Let's do it. Let's get to Berg. I think I want to go survive as resilience. I think I kind of have to. Breakthrough skill gives you forty bonus to your health. Um, and that's the that's the goal to survive in the hardcore mode. All right, so. I'm going to stop it right here. We'll pick up next time. Thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. Continue on with us. Well, bye.